Hello everybody and welcome back to Warrior Link's Gauntlet! Today, we are going to be going to the Water Temple. And, we'll ask ourselves the age-old question. Can you beat the Water Temple without the Zora Tunic? <laughs> almost forgot the name for a second there. Yeah, the Zora Tunic. We're not... Sorry about that, just dropped the microphone. So yeah, as you can see, as soon as I can click it, there is no Zora Tunic or Goron Tunic in our inventory. We already did the Fire Temple with, without the Goron Tunic, so now we're going to do the Water Temple with no Zora Tunic. Let's go. In my previous experience, this was a lot easier, but I don't know, maybe the 3DS version will be different. I feel like it'll probably be easier since the Iron Boots are an item. Uh, you know, different from the N64 version where you had to go, you had to pause and equip them every time and stuff. So yeah, we're just uh, gonna get right on into it. I think first you need to sink all the way down to the bottom and find Ruto. There we go. That little area down there. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. You can <laughs> you can keep on switching the iron boots on and off to kind of switch the timer on and off a few times. So that's nice. And obviously Link won't drown during cutscenes like this. Do you hear how much I'm mashing the buttons? I'll, I'll try to keep that to a minimum. <laughs> And just to, just in case you're worried about the fact that I'm playing on an emulator, um, I mean, yeah, it's illegal technically, but I do own the game. I've owned it twice on 3DS, um, and there's no other way for me to record 3DS games other than with Citra. So yeah, I mean, you probably already knew that, though. I guess there technically is another way to record 3DS games, but it costs so much money. And you don't even get like a good 3DS to go with it, if I remember right. Oh no wait, this is just, uh, oh, oh well. <laughs> Last time I played it was the Master Quest version, and I remembered that you had to get a, a small key in here. By like hookshotting that weird poster thing on the wall, but this is the original version, so there's no weird hookshotting posters to get keys. Is there? Okay, yeah, that that does nothing. Just had to check. And we'll pull out Din's fire. Come on, click the... There we go. You can do that with the bow, but it's just a lot easier to use Din's fire. Those guys are, well, pretty easy, as long as you can just take control of them. Let's raise the water level a little bit. I want to get that other key that requires the bomb before I forget. Hey. 
I mean, I personally, I don't think they really had to do this, but, I mean, you can see they put the, the little water level thing right here. They didn't have that in the N64 version. Uh, I think that's a little unnecessary since they're already kind of in the spot where the water level would go down, except for the low water one. But what makes it really easy and, de and really, in my opinion, a lot nicer is uh, those lines on the walls that are colored. And that's just really nice that they did that. I just realized I might not have fairies. Oh, okay, I have two. I can probably work with that. Okay, <laughs> that's one fairy down. Hopefully I won't need to use any more. I think I saw something up there. Oh, no, no, not this one. Oh, no. Oh, good. Yeah. We can breathe again. Oh, I forgot about the timer cancel. I forgot about the timer cancel thing. I should have remembered that. save any air. I guess it's like in the fire temple where you have to be out of the dangerous area for a while. I think for the most part we're fine though. enough to get a long shot now. Maybe we need three. I forget. Didn't mean to do that. 16 seconds again? Why? Why not give me my full 24 back? Alright, the water level needs to be low for that. <sighs> oh, there's a... there's a thing up here. He's gonna murder me. No. Oh. oh, there he is. <laughs> Still got me. Even when I was ready. I thought he usually came down sooner. Let's move 
back up, go back up, go back up. Okay. Catch our breath for a while. We get 12 seconds again. No! Okay. Man, I just don't give you any time. I don't remember having to do this in the N64 version. Maybe they changed it. Oh, well, I'm pretty sure you're just supposed to move the block and then you then just get out of there. Then you go down from the other area. Yet, or I mean the long shot. Hmm. Maybe we need to go down here. Did I already go down here? Oh, we can't do this yet. Oh, the lag. Why is it lagging all of a sudden? I keep forgetting that I can mash B to swim faster. I'm used to Majora's Mask where you can't do that. And we are so dead. Don't know why I didn't catch more breath. <laughs> okay, no. What, really? That close? Come on. Come on, dude. Okay, no more fairies lost. I didn't mean to press B. Let's do it right this time. Was, did I just not take damage because I rolled after it or because it was a cutscene? Maybe they just fixed it in the 3DS version. Because I remember sometimes taking damage there. There we go, Link. What are you doing? I 
I wonder if you can save air by diving first. Because you never really lose air when you dive. I don't really remember where to go, but I just remember this temple isn't really that hard. I know a lot of people say it is, but I never really had much trouble with it, except for when I was like seven. I mean, as long as you're just looking around and exploring, then you're not gonna be lost for too long. I used to think it was possible to use the keys in the wrong order and just be stuck, but no. Nintendo doesn't work like that. It just means you gotta find more keys. here. Yeah, that looks doable. Okay, now we have two keys. Hopefully this should be enough to... I just still have this feeling that you need three keys. Get up here. No, you need the long shot. I think we should just try for the long shot now. Or maybe the last key will come to me. That's right, this has the compass. Did, did they really make- oh yeah, that's right, it's the other way around. <laughs> you have to hook shut the crystal. Or shoot it with a bow? 
Yeah. I thought I remembered this one puzzle where you had to hit the crystal and then hook shot to the treasure chest, but I don't know. can see the chests now on the map. Oh yeah, we can't get to that one. To the top it is then. still feel like you definitely need a third key. Maybe that's where the third key is. did that part. Never mind. <laughs> I think that's the area where you need to shoot the arrow and stuff like that. Why isn't my hookshot working? Did my... No, I'm still able to do everything else. Oh, it's smashed in? It still feels like I'm pressing... There we go. I don't know what happened. That was weird. Let's hope we only need two keys. Maybe I'm just remembering the Master Quest version again. One more key. You can't see the door from here. Soon, my brothers. Easy. I mean, this puzzle is already pretty easy, it's just a little tedious.
After hitting the switch so many times, we can finally get up here. And looks like we don't need a key. I I heard online one time that um, Dark Link is really easy if you use the hammer, so we're gonna test that out. Personally, I usually prefer the, the Goron Sword, because, I mean, you can get it before even going into the Forest Temple, but you might not have the, the Goron Sword, but you most likely have the Megaton Hammer. Yeah, this is... this is not easier. In fact, I'd say it's definitely harder than just, than just swinging your sword a lot without L-targeting. gets away from spins, but it's dead in three hits with the Master Sword. doesn't work if you're not if you're standing on it. I played the wrong song. You have to play the song of time, not Zelda's lullaby. Come on, you know this link. Oh yeah, it's this one where you need to hit the switch, and then hookshot to the chest. And again, that's an eye switch, so maybe it doesn't drop back down. Oh, it does. Okay. Now all we need to do is get the boss key and get out of here. And we will have successfully done the challenge with almost no problem. This is surprisingly easy. And I mean, as I said before in the Fire Temple one, as long as you have fairies, you can do anything.
don't, don't use a fairy, don't use a fairy. Come on, just make it. Good. Wow, did a full 24 seconds again. That's nice. No, 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 please! There's nothing I can do! I couldn't do anything to make him go faster. Great, now I wasted my last fairy. Look at Link's beautiful face. <laughs> Let's just play it right this time. Can I just jump straight to the... that part? That'd be nice. No. They probably placed it, play tested that a few times. need to push it to this wall, then go around and pull it from the other side. to go through the hallway. Maybe 
that's why people don't like the water temple. Not that it's really hard, it's just a little tedious. I personally still think it's, like, really a pretty good temple. Not bad. No, okay, good. exactly where it is. And I forgot it. Oh well. I think I might just uh, clip here. So yeah, I'll see you guys in a little bit. Okay. So, here's where we need to be, so that we can shoot this switch right here. And hook shot in here. Then we can push this block and grab the final key that's not the boss key. Final small key. All we needed to do. And wait, what? Why did it move back? So yeah, now we need to find our way back to the area where we can raise the water level. Then we lower the water level and go back to where we were before. Shot there, is that possible? Well, I guess it would be if I bothered to get the Scarecrow song. raise the water level or fail trying to do so Okay, it said it so many times I, I didn't even try it. We're gonna try the dive trick now. It still doesn't seem like it saved us that much time. Wait, was it this way? Or... No, wait. 
There's a map. <laughs> I can follow the map. Or just walk right past the entrance where you're supposed to go. That works too. to do the puzzle again, so that's nice. <laughs> that's what I was afraid would happen last time. Is the other one still up there? Okay, he's near the door, so maybe the tick tight won't get me. Okay, he fell off. Fabled boss key? Big key? I forget which one they call it in this game. The boss key, yeah, as they should. Is big key only a link to the past when it just refers to the treasure chest that gives you the item instead of. I don't know. So the boss door. Does it also do the boss door? It's been a while since I played a link to the past. I just remember there were some games that called it the boss key and some games that called it the big key. Can I just backflip over this one? Yeah, I don't even get hurt, I think. Do we need to raise the water level all the way back up again? Yeah, I think we do. Okay, it's the last time though. Wait, we're already at... <laughs> Why do I always forget how the temple works? We're already at the bottom level. So we gotta go medium then top. there. Just a little farther.
thought it was going to be the next room. But let's grab those fairies. boots anymore. I think rolling makes you go back down. So yeah. Just gotta take a little slow. Is that huh? what's on the platform? Let's go investigate. What a human, or uh, I mean, a Hylian. I'm the big brain core thing, Morpha, the giant aquatic amoeba. Excuse me. If you do it just right, you can like, destroy this boss by cornering him and then stabbing him with the Bigoron sword. And I beat him in like six seconds. I don't think you can be so lucky with the Master Sword. Well, I don't know. Maybe you can. Oh, he got away. No, 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 come back. No. Yeah, it was just a joke. He's back on land again. Land, we got him. So there we go. We have proven that it is indeed very possible and really not even that difficult to beat the Water Temple without the Zora Tunic. So thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys in the next video. Or maybe the next stream. Who knows? Yeah, I won't. I won't be showing all the way through the cutscenes because you know Nintendo doesn't like that stuff. So yeah, I'll see you guys next time.